everybody in the society always preaches you asks you to go after success the entire society is built over a concept of success and nobody really pays attention to failures but it's very important for us to break out of this rut and to focus on something that is larger than success that is excellence if you remember the movie three idiots it is very beautifully explained in that movie and in a very entertaining way that if you chase excellence success will chase you and i would like to reiterate that as a mantra for your life we should always try to do our job in such a way that nobody else is able to do that to such a great extent that is the key to success if you do the job that is next to you with so much of dedication and with meticulous precision you will be given jobs that are more and more of value and more responsibility that you will come up in your whole life this is what narayan murthy also told so our society it is basically like a giant zombie factory that's what i call it it's a zombie factory from day one people are telling us to get good marks when we reach the school and it's all about getting a great marks and grades in your uh, exams in 10th grade and 12th grade and you go to an iit or an nit and all these top colleges and once you reach these top colleges people are asking you to get a good campus placement it's all about getting into campus placement once you get into a campus placement society is putting pressure on you basically to get a, a great pay package and it's all about comparison with other people out there who's getting a, a more pay package and stuff and once you do this it's all about people are asking you especially your parents they're pushing you to get married by the time you are like 22 23 either either you are like a girl or a boy you you just get pushed into marrying and then after you get married it's not going to stop there then they're going to chase you to have a kid so then you have a kid and it will not stop even then people are going to ask you one is not enough you have to have a second one so you get into that peer pressure and then you have a second kid and in between all that they're going to ask you do you have a house or do you have an apartment you say no and then they're going to basically say that you're worthless you're useless you don't have a societal standing so what do you do you succumb under that pressure and you go out there and you buy an apartment in in bangalore or delhi or mumbai nothing is going to come below 1 crore so basically you buy a property and then you st- you're stuck with an emi of at least 1 lakh a, a month for the rest of your life so you tell me can you take risks after you have this kind of an emi you cannot so your risk appetite your risk taking abilities go out of the window This is what happens if you try to chase success according to what the society has told you to. You need to break out of this rut. You need to break out of this zombie factory. And you can only do that by chasing what you love to do, by going after your passion and chasing excellence in your particular domain. Once you find your passion, go after excellence. Be it dancing, be it movie making, you know, be it uh, horse riding or entrepreneurship or whatever it is at the end of the day what really matters is success will come to you only if you chase excellence that's the bottom line so whatever these guys told you in 3 dates i completely endorse it